Welcome to my latest video. This is just a quick project on replacing the eyes on soft plastic fishing layers. I have a tendency when I put the hooks on to, to force the eyes out and then lose them in the water or the tackle box. And rather than replace them with standard soft plastic fishing eyes and, and a bit of super glue, I use a method with sequins and a bit of fishing line. It also means I can add them to layers that don't normally come with them, such as grubs or even worms and flukes. Enjoy the video. The tools and materials I'm using for this project are 50 pound monofilament fishing line, a gas lighter that I've borrowed from the kitchen, a marker pen, forceps, cocktail stick and a pair of scissors, some 4mm black sequins, some 6 to 7mm holographic sequins, and obviously my one eyed fishing layer. I'll post a link to the list of tools and materials in the description below the video. So the first job I'm going to do is just poke out that other eye and then stab through between the eyes just to make a hole. So I can put that to one side for a second. I've got some 50 pound line here, this is monofilament. It's actually shock leader but anything will do that's just, just heavy. I'm going to cut off a couple of inches 50 mil and then take a lighter and just melt the end I'm going to wet my finger and just flatten that off a bit then I'm going to get my sequins these are six mil or quarter these are just holographic flat sequins and for the pupil I'm using black these are actually supplied on a thread. I'll just see if I can get a couple off. So to begin with, I'm going to thread one of the black. Black sequins on first, then a silver. Get my fish back. I'm going to pull that right the way through. So for the other side, silver first. Then black. And what I'm going to do is use a pair of clamps and I'm going to pull everything tight, squeeze the head, and the pupils, and just clamp it up like that. You can see that the head there is compressed. And I'm going to trim, I'm leaving probably under a quarter of an inch, so probably four or five mil. And again, I'm going to heat that up. and take it back down to the clamp and wet my finger just flatten that off I'll leave that just a second just to just to cool down and then I can undo the clamp and that's it I can just push these into position into the old sockets and then I'm going to take a marker and just colour in the end of the line there, black the same as the pupil. That's the job done. And get back out and do some fishing. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to share, like, subscribe, or follow the links to my channel for more videos. Thanks for watching.